one of the common aspects of mobile phones is that they are connected by radio to the network and radio implicitly is unreliable. I was working at a company that was developing third-party product for sale to handset manufacturers. That's when I got exposed to the way that network operators currently monitor their service and I decided at that time, which was you know, five or six years ago, that uh, a more appropriate way of doing it would be to do it from within my handset because I'm the one receiving the service rather than from within the network which was trying to deliver the service. So left the company, started Wodaro. Darsbury captured my interest because of the significant input put into the building by the people that manage it to get people together to try and squeeze as much value out of relationships. And one regular event that I like going to is the business breakfast. It's usually very early on a Friday morning and uh, companies here and outside are invited to just come together to talk and you just see 150 different faces, some of them are resident here. Some of them come from outside looking to come here, uh, sell services into here to maybe find partnerships here. And it's a good way in a very short period of time of getting a conversation with somebody. So, you know, the delegates list is publicised. You can see who's going to be there and you can pick them out of the crowd. As an aspect of being here in the Innovation Centre, uh, we have benefited from access to funding sources, for example. It's not free money. Uh, you are introduced to support opportunities through organisations like the NWDA, UK Trade and Investment, and you've also been introduced, we've been introduced, to people that can help um, secure that funding in terms of applications, the right process to follow, the right people to talk to. So although you could do that anywhere else, it does seem to be something that's quite well practised here and fairly smooth. So we have uh, secured uh, an R&D grant um, that was a, had a capital value of £75,000 to us and without that it would have been a little bit difficult to research some of the technology that we ended up patenting. Um, we've also had some support from UK Trade and Investment for some of our international business development so there are certain examples of places that we've been to which we couldn't have afforded to go to otherwise. There's a you know, always kind of a, an upbeat atmosphere around here. It, I suppose you have to expect that because you've got a, a group of entrepreneurs who can't help but be upbeat about what they're doing. If they, if they weren't, they wouldn't be here. So you do have that kind of um, breezy atmosphere, and levity in your conversations, which is quite good. So it's fun to be here. Um, there are times when, it, when you need to be serious and there's a lot to do. So you, if, if you need space and peace and quiet, you can get that also. But, um, you know, there's no shortage of people to talk to here. If it's not in the building, you can walk across the road to the laboratories. There's people to see there and things to do. So it's just a very good atmosphere. I mean, it's a really good place to site a business.